kid, I, I was the one in my family that absolutely loved animals, all animals, and in particular dolphins. I was that little girl that had her bedroom full of dolphins, and on birthdays and Christmas, everyone gave me something with dolphins. Naturally, SeaWorld was the place to be. I grew up in Mexico and right across the border in Tijuana. Every two years or so, whenever my parents could, we would come to SeaWorld and I would go directly to the dolphin show and say, that's gonna be me one day. I took the steps to come to work at SeaWorld and I did a few seasons with the rescue and rehab program, manatees, sea lions, seals, and then finally dolphins. I did get to work with the dolphins, which was my dream and now with otters and hopefully there's going to be other animals that I get to work with in the future. I have met people that when they find out that I work with animals they're excited and want to know everything about it. I tell them I work with sea otters and there has been some people that don't know what a sea otter is. It makes sense. Sea otters are a threatened species. So then that's my opportunity to teach and make them love sea otters. And It's also important the education part. Just even the smallest thing of how not to litter. I'll never forget how when I was a little girl and I learned that trash was very damaging to, to animals. I was in the car with my dad and he was about to throw trash out the window and I stopped him. I said, Papa, <laughs> Dad, what are you doing? And he said that, he tell, he's telling me the story, that he, he looks at my face and he saw my big eyes and said, wow, what I'm doing is wrong. So. I'm not gonna do it anymore and ever since my dad doesn't litter either and it's that that power that power that little kid has and for me it started with the love of the animal.